<laughs> you have busted your nut, bro. <laughs> Early November, and you have already busted your nut. November 5th, you busted your nut. Not even five days. You told yourself it'll, it'll be working this time, but it didn't. Oh, what do you do? <laughs> I'm laughing at you, bro, because you should be ashamed of yourself. <clears throat> like, I'm not gonna be one of those guys that don't like you. I know you've busted your nut. I know you have relapse. Don't feel bad, bro. Don't feel guilty, bro. You should be genuinely feeling bad for yourself. Is this what your bloodline, your ancestors have fought for? Here is you. You cannot even control your PP for five days. I wanna make this clear. Now, you should feel bad, yes. But you should also take responsibility for whatever has happened. And going forward, you must be in this mindset of like, yeah, whatever has happened, has happened. The more you think about it, the worse it gets. So think of it like this. I've been like on NoFap for more than a year, right? I've had those days. Those times, it was just like NoFap was not even a thing anymore. Fapping was not even a thing anymore. If I were to ask you this question, do you remember the date of a particular event on history? Maybe the day Hitler joined one of the organization or whatever, right? You would like you wouldn't be able to answer that. Normally we wouldn't remember those dates because it's irrelevant. It's because we haven't like repeatedly studied it. Because the things we repeat, we remember it's the same thing with it's the same thing with fapping bro. You remember fapping. You remember no fap. That's the problem. You must forget it. To forget it, you must live a life of purpose. A life of purpose. The purpose could be fixing your mental health. In fact, you know what? Fixing your mental health is the single most best thing that you can ever do on your journey of no fab. So what are you waiting for? Let me tell you, this opportunity right here is of self-improvement. If you have been fapping like I was, if you love fapping, you have no self-control, you masturbate a lot, you're young, you're going to school, <clears throat> you know, you have your school works as well, and you're kind of like working out as well, bro, self-improvement will save you, saving your mental health will save you, it will help you a lot on this journey, it has for me as well, and I'm talking with experience, you must take this new, new step, become a new person, a person that fixes his mental health, because the thing is, people try to like quit, <coughs> quit fapping, bro, how are you gonna quit fapping? You struggle with mental health issues. You may think that you don't have mental health issues, but bro, if you if you find your tendency to derive, I mean to not derive, but to indulge in instant gratification pleasures, bro, there's some issue. Maybe your dopamine f dopamine receptors are fucked up, so you try to seek pleasures from you know, masturbation and porn instead of just doing real work, real talks, getting shit done in real. You know, completing your studies, getting good grades in your exam. Those are the real dopamine. And self-improvement is the key to fixing your mental first. Because as long as this is bad, no matter what tactics you're trying on NoFap, it wouldn't work, bro. So step number one, work on your mental health. Be responsible that you have lost. And be also accountable that it would not happen again. Just just take it lightly, bro. Uh, yeah, I'm just fapped. Oh uh, yeah, it's, it was just an oopsie, <laughs> right? But uh, you should genuinely be concerned, bro. Like, fuck. Fapping at this day and age, you're fucking losing. I'm gonna be honest, you're fucking losing if you're doing that. There's like a race to be won. There's so much to achieve in life if you're still struggling with that, bro. Mm, you gotta get the foundation right, bro. And I'm rooting for you. <clears throat> So, yeah, my name is Kiwi, I'm a self-improvement YouTuber, this is my YouTube channel, so you can subscribe to it if you're into self-improvement, or if you're getting into it, and I'm gonna be posting videos consistently, and I'm also gonna be having a live webinar this weekend on Sunday, so I'm gonna link that in the description so that you can join that, improve your life one step at a time, always.